want to know how to make a time-lapse video in DaVinci Resolve, you're about to find out how. Hi, I'm Greg M and thanks for checking out my video. Today we're going to cover the simple task of making a time-lapse video in DaVinci Resolve. So let's get started. The first thing we need to do is make sure our media is organised properly. Now these images here were imported from my uh, GoPro and I've got them in this folder called one TL. Here we've got it open and there's uh, about 480 images. They're numbered sequentially. Um, I've taken them over a period of about 40 minutes at five second intervals. So let's go into DaVinci Resolve and we'll get started with it. First thing we're going to do is uh, import that folder. Let's drag the whole folder containing the images to the media pool. Okay, once that uh, becomes red, means they're ready to go, we can drag them down to the timeline. Now, the images are fairly poor quality. There's just a few uh, edits that I need to do to get them to some decent standard. First thing I need to do is go to color. And I'm not gonna do a full edit, but we'll just throw in a bit of uh, light into that to brighten them a little. And that should work fine for now. Now back to the edit window. I'm gonna click on the clip, which will open up our inspector. Click and hold and drag on the zoom and I want to zoom in, not out. Zoom in to about there. Also to uh, eliminate some of the, the uh, effects of the wide, wide angle camera, I'm going to uh, change the pitch a little. Just bring it back, oh, wrong way. Bring the pitch back and it'll straighten those buildings up a little on the, on the outsides. That looks fine. If we uh, hit the space bar, it will start running through. And it's very, very choppy, but that's fine. We can work with that. Now, before I export it, I just want to uh, change the uh, clip speed a little. I want to slow it down for a better effect. And I'm just going to add some music. So the first thing I'll do is uh, Hover over here and right click, and I'm going to change the clip speed, which is right there. Click on that, and I'm going to pull it down to about 50%. There you go, and click change. Now, just for a moment, I need to Quit this highlighter. It won't allow me to drag this out with the highlighter on for some reason. And I'm going to extend the clip out to the length there. Let's just put the highlighter back on. The last thing I want to do before I export it is um, just add a little bit of music to it. So I'm going to drag this music track into the media pool and then drag it down to the timeline. Okay, now I'm just going to increase the uh, size of that a little bit. Select my blade. I'm going to cut the music at the end. Go back to the pointer, click on that section and hit delete. Okay, for the next thing I just need to hide this highlighter again. I'm going to uh, fade the music out at the end a little. Drag that down like that, and I want to fade the music in at the start. And I'm going to need to change the volume on audio 1, because I know it's going to be very high. We'll go back to the start of the clip. I 
Okay, that should be fine. Now I'm going to go to the Deliver tab here. I'm going to name it. I'll call it, I'll call it Time Lapse 2. And I need to give it a location I want it to download to. So I'll click there, select my desktop, save. I then need to just check that that's fine. I need to add it to the render queue and then come across here and click start render. Now that's going to take a couple of moments uh, to, to render. So I'll pause the video right now and I'll come right back as soon as it's rendered. Right, we're back and there's just a few seconds remaining before the render finishes. We're at 98% now, 99%. And it's finished. So let's minimize this. And uh, we need to go to desktop. And that's our video there. I'll click and open it. And let's see how it looks. So there you have it, that's how you make a time-lapse video in DaVinci Resolve. I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did, give it a like and subscribe to my channel. I'm Greg M, thanks for watching and have a good one.